for me Ramadan is a time that I get to you know do what I really love and share it with people that I love uh, more than I would in other months so it's a month that we come together um, iftars are usually you know take a little while it's not a quick meal that you eat and and you get up and go on so we sit around a table we catch up we discuss plans it, it breathes this uh, uh, sense of awareness the humanity that we make some sometimes forget during the hustle and puzzle as everybody's running and going about their lives so I'm Iranian and my children are actually Amarati so it's a marriage of the two cultures and we usually do rice dishes with some sort of chicken or beef uh, they're not cranberries they're not they're kind of family of goji berries these are very sour so we add saffron and sugar to it um, and we fry them very very lightly um, and this gets added to the rice with pistachios and it gives it a very like tangy flavor um, to the rice basically it's um, uh, chicken that we put lots of different herbs in it so it has turmeric um, it has lots of saffron <laughs> as we put it's got bay leaves um, it, it's got bad, bad peppers uh, salt pepper um, garlic and onions and then we just let it slow cook and then we add a little bit of tomato paste on top of it this soup uh, is a vegetable broth um, carrots and um, uh, whole grain barley um, not split barley's whole barley's uh, with some coriander um, and some um, onions in it uh, a little bit of tomato paste um, and some potatoes kind of after soup between mains sometimes people have salad sometimes they don't um, we definitely have the Iranian tea ready uh, with uh, roast flour and saffron in it with dates and we break our fast the first thing is actually a bit of tea and dates that's the first thing that we do um, try to drink warm liquids than water or juice if need to be um, this again is a very very traditional Iranian dessert it's a it's our version of rice pudding literally um, it's made with Egyptian rice so it gives it that sticky consistency I think you know aside from it being a a cultural and a religious celebration what is beautiful about Ramadan um, is that it by default the nature of the month slows everybody down um, I wouldn't have the opportunity to have my family and friends over for a normal dinner I wouldn't make it home in time to cook um, they would not be done with work and so we get to see each other on weekends I همه آرامش رو یز کنن همه سلامت باشن و خانواده من هم در پناه خدا باشن و سفری لیلا همیشه پر از برکت سایش سر بچه هاش و همه چیزای خوب و خوشحالی باشن